here all day going down through this list. <laughs> What's going on, man? I don't know who all's in here. Shows I got three people. Hey, hey. <laughs> right? I'm going to try this stuff today. Never tried it. See how it's going to work. Yep. Good morning, everybody. That, I'm going to use this bad boy. And it's going to be the second use on these blades right here. The pink. See how them is going to go. I got this, but I'm not a big post shave, you know, um, I don't think I'm going to use this. Not this morning, anyhow. <clears throat> but I did bloom this soap a little bit. It's got some water in it. And I'm going to be using this brush. I actually made this one for myself, the first one I made for myself, because I wanted something different. <laughs> and it actually, I don't know if you can see that, it goes down inside there, so it's got like a, a crook inside. I want to see how that works as a lather catcher. <laughs> it's alright, Justin. Take some of this soap out of this and put it on my face and go to town. As you can hear, my son's in the background this morning. <laughs> He's up and going to town. It's like he knows when I'm going to shave and he grabs his truck and he goes back and forth on the floor. Well, just off the you know, the water I took out of this from where I had it blooming, it, uh, it's pretty slick. I just hope I can get it to lather pretty good and go from there. I'm just going straight to it. And the knot that I got in this, it's actually from Maggard's. It's a half boar and half badger. So... And it's not broke in, so it'll be kind of, kind of rough. But that's all right. It's part of the fun of it, right? Take some of this here. Now I heard that this stuff can be kind of hard to lather, so I'm hoping I can get it going pretty good. Yeah, I know, I'm due for a haircut. This stuff don't smell too bad, though. Make sure I got it on pretty thick and then I'm gonna add some water and see how that goes. Yeah, they uh they've been around. You can get them from Maggards. I know Maggards has them. Um I'm not positive where else you can get them, but how you doing, Gerard? Yeah, I ain't shaving my head. <laughs> I've done that once. Couldn't sleep. It was a bad deal. Alright, now, now that I got a pretty decent ladder, I'm gonna add some water to it. See where I can go from there.
I just want to make sure it's slick, especially me using that commie. Oh yeah, stuff's starting to fly off. Getting pretty decent lather now. There we go, guys. Hey, and check this out. My lather catcher works. That's awesome. I like that. <laughs> I might uh, I might have to make some more like that. That way it don't get on your hands. Yeah. That's sweet. Didn't know if it'd work or not. That's why I said, well, I'm gonna have to keep this in myself and just try it out. Alright, here we go. This is the second use on this blade. Yeah, I'm sure I'll be making some more. I'm, I won't have no more resin and stuff in. I got it ordered, but it won't be in until Thursday or Friday. So it'll be a little while. Um, but yeah, I'm. now that I see that, and even after it's set, and that's, you know, stuff just sets right in that little lip. I like that. Now my daughter's wanting in here, you hear that? <laughs> yeah, she's trying to get in. She's turning the door handle and all. <laughs> Oh yeah, this soap is pretty slick, even after, like, I actually like this stuff. It's, um, it says Commissori on it, and then it says Commissori 1. So I'll post the uh, I'll post the box it comes in and everything when I'm done doing this. Not sure where to get them. Um, I know my buddy Lee sent me some shaving stuff and that was in there. He's a good sniper, but um, he's not a. He oh, he's in here now. I better I better watch it. <laughs> no, he he's a good sniper, but he gives it away. <laughs> I knew he sent it when I got my uh, them two straight razors that he had sent. And he wrote me a little note, and he said, well, now you can do your side-by-side. Side. So I knew it was Lee.
I will tell you the second use on these these blades kind of remind me of a feather blade. You know how when you use a feather blade, the first use is a little rough, but the second use, that's what I'm getting out of these out of these pink blades here. I guess I could turn them right side up, right? Um, but it's more comfortable on the second, you know, the second go around than the first. So far, so good. Yeah, they're pretty nice. Look at that. Now, well, the knot's coming out, but now that's all the way around in there. Just holding, holding on. Not all over my brush. I'm not going to get, you know, soap on my hands and try to use a straight razor or a commissory. I like that. So yeah, I'll be doing some more like this one, that's for sure. And I got one, I got a blank I'm gonna show you guys too here shortly. Um, as soon as I get done with this. I don't know if you guys seen my motorcycle brush that I'm working on. I got something kind of similar to that that I'm doing too. I got the blank. I'm gonna, if I get time today, I'm gonna be working on the motorcycle one and getting that and finished and working on this other blank that I got. I used to go up, but I noticed if I go down and then side to side and kind of go up a little bit because my grain is kind of like that here, then I can get it and it's it's smooth and I don't have to try to go up. Yeah, have a good one, Justin. Well, so far I've got no reaction out of this soap, so that's that's a plus. Have a good one, man. pretty good shave now I rinse that stuff off because I don't know. It's not Russell soap. <laughs> it's not the Wild West Shaving Co. I leave that stuff on. But I don't know exactly what all's in this and I don't wanna I don't wanna try it. I got some witch hazel. I keep it in this little bottle that I got from Walmart. That way it's not this great big huge thing sitting here on the counter. Then I'm gonna go with, let's see. 
Ah, oh, heck. I'm a, I need to get me some more skin bracer. Look at that. I'll go with this stuff. This is pretty good stuff. You can get it at Walmart. It smells pretty good. Oh, yeah. It gives a little bit of the burn. Yeah, it's, I get a better shave going like that. It just, you know, it's a lot smoother and I don't have to try to fight, you know, to get it to. All right. Well, and it's still holding up after all that time I used it. Look at that. Got that stuff just sitting right there. All right, check this out, guys. Hold on, let, let me get me, let me get me a drink real quick. Got my nice cup here. Check that out. All right, are you guys ready for this? Now it's a blank, so it's not going to be so shiny. Check that out. Perfectly centered, but when you look at it, it looks like the handlebars is touching the top, but it's not. It's actually perfectly centered. I think that's going to be awesome. I'm going to be working on this today. Got some other stuff going. And the brushes I got posted for 20% off <clears throat> is every brush that I got made so far. Um, I don't have any of them right here other than this one. But this one here is tall. I mean, tall, tall. I got big hands, so, you know. But the reason I put those lines like I do is because different people have different size hands. You know, some people feel comfortable like that. I can grab it like this and still have, you know, grip here if I got bigger hands, you know. So that's my whole theory on that. The reason I do them, all them lines and grooves. Um, because I know not everybody has the same size hand. And me, if I'm grabbing a brush, I like something I can grab onto. You know, something that's not going to slip out of my hand. That was my whole reason for doing this. If I could figure out some way to get that lather not to go to the bottom. So, but that was a pretty good shave. Um, like I said, I got everything 20% off until, actually I have it till Monday, but I'll probably change it until Tuesday. Because I know people's, you know, out for Memorial Day and, you know, got stuff going on and they're all running around. And this way it gives everybody to get in, you know, get a chance to, if they see something they want, to get it and save some money. Um, so I'll probably end up knocking that up until Tuesday or maybe even, maybe even Wednesday. That way to give you, you know, people time to get home and, you know, get settled away. Because I know a lot of people's traveling this weekend. So, but... Thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'm going to get off here and clean this stuff up. And that knot, it's not bad. I don't have any of these knots in stock because I'm not even, you know, sure of the price on them. Um, a buddy of mine, Charles, had got it and didn't like it. So he sent me the knot. So I put that. I just, I've hang, I've had holding on to it until I found something I wanted to put it in. And I thought it looked pretty good in there. But... Y'all have a good one. Hope you guys have a rest of a great weekend. And I'm out.